Hey guys, what's up? It is Dave here with another video, and today we are talking about the super sweet new Pro Boat Jet Street. This thing is a ton of fun to drive. It is an absolute blast. I cannot express how much fun I had driving this thing. Most fun I've ever had driving a boat. Um, but that being said, being a jet boat and being this size, this big, this heavy, um, I will admit it was a little underwhelming when it came to the speed. Not exactly the fastest boat out there, but man was this fun. <laughs> I can't even express. Uh, I just keep repeating myself, clearly. Um, but we took it out on a lake. Obviously open water probably isn't what this is really meant for. It's kind of more meant for running like in the creek and in rapids and things like that and here we don't at least where i'm at in michigan we're not super close to rapids we're just uh close to creeks and things like that so i got it out and ran it in some smaller areas bounced it off a couple rocks tested its durability a little bit um and it it held up it it really it did good so let's jump into it a little bit more and go a little more in depth with some of this close get a little bit closer up of uh, some stuff all right so with the top off it's super easy to get to they are just held in by magnets so it comes off super easy but still secure enough that you can run this thing into tree not trees but run it into rocks and other things such as i did and never had anything come off which was great um but with the top off you can see there's an on off switch for both the esc the boat itself um, and then there's also an on off switch for the LEDs because this thing is super cool and has LED lights on the back that flash and a light bar on the front and they both function so it looks super cool if you're driving at sundown or you know just when it starts to get dark. So another cool little function is this jet boat has reverse which basically means you click little third channel button on the SLT3 and the servo will actually actuate this piece that allows the water to basically flow backwards and push this propel this boat backwards so it's great to have reverse because sometimes you get in the weeds or get into a pickle and need to get out we had this thing out in the lake open water super fun but again a little underwhelming as far as speed goes on a four cell we were running a gens ace 5500 milliamp four cell got about 10 15 minutes roughly out of it um, which isn't too terrible i mean it is a big boat it is a heavy boat so be prepared to have more batteries i mean most it's pretty common with this being a jet boat, you can run it in shallower water than you would a normal boat. So running it in creeks and things like that are great. However, I will say watch out for debris and leaves now that we're getting into fall. I mean, those things are potential hazards as they can get sucked up underneath and cause you to have a loss of power. One thing that happened to me when out running in the creek was I actually sucked up some leaves up in there and they blocked the airflow, which basically caused me to have the problem of the boat wasn't fast enough to fight the current. So it was really fun to try to recover that thing. But just a precaution when out running in smaller more confined areas and with coming up into fall and that is the pro boat jet stream get one now 549 this thing's not cheap but it is super fun and as always be sure to like comment share and subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one